video. Let's implement the normal rules for king without considering the canceling. Okay, canceling is uh, more involved. So let's create our test case first. So wow, we already have yeah test. Let's create one for king test. Um, queen rules. Okay, so king rules. So let's create one like. Hmm. Let's use this one as the template. So if we have a king here, for example, king, white king, right? Uh, oh, what's this? This is not good. We don't need that. Do we have a problem here? Oh, yes, here. So let's fix that and make it perfect. OK. So king can move to, yeah, one, two, three, eight, eight locations, right? So we can create a, yeah, create a game here and uh, put the king there, right? Insert a king. Okay. Let's put a king here. So three, yeah, three, three, and uh, white, yes. So it's king. So that's test, right? It cannot move. Um, yeah, so it cannot move to like its original location. So we can do xct assert force game dot can oh can piece move okay can move piece this guy from say three and three two three and three it, okay three here save and run it this will pass because we already have the logic to handle this case okay now next one if it shouldn't right be able to jump like the more to move more than one step so for example to um to here put x here okay it cannot be though so it's five three So run that, it will fail. Then we can add our, yeah. Now let's go back to our code. To, yeah, game chess engine. Chess engine, let's add a one here. Function can, okay, let's make a copy of that to save some time. copy and uh, paste so can move king from here what do you think how do we implement the normal move constraints for our king right so if we don't consider the tethering this is the only thing we need to uh, handle. Okay, so now let's make a copy of that for our for our king. Control I. So this will be king. Can move king. Okay, now let's go back to test. Run it. 
it works. Now let's put a true assertion. Okay. So it should be able to move to um four three right yeah here is okay here is okay so four yeah it works now let's try on the simulator okay so this one let's run it to make sure king follows right the rule okay so king this is the king let's do here oh great we caught a bug right so uh, we can add a test case for this one so it means this guy has to be tested so a third force like that right so this guy will be four one okay four one yeah to mimic this pattern okay so now run it it will fail so we need to add more constraint yeah so let's go back to our what do we need to add so can king where is king here so we need to add more one more condition what is that The sum of them has to be less than three. So let's do that. So let's put uh, this one like delta, delta uh, column, right? Column equals that. Okay. So delta row equals this guy so the sum of them has to be that stands three at minimum is at minimum is at minimum it should be two right so the delta for the king to here is is one here the sum of them is two it cannot be three right one two three okay so is delta colon either that or that but the sum of them has to be less than the sum of them has to be less than three Now let's test again. Okay. Let's try it on simulator. This king, right? So go. Oh, no. Okay. So let's move out our king. Now, so this one, the king is here. Let's do that. So king should be able to, can we go there? No. So can we go here? Yes. So this one go out. So now let's try this. Okay, no. That. What about this? Yeah, this works. So we try this guy. Yeah, like that and uh, let's go okay so go here um, go here this go back okay so can we go there yes can we go here yes 
So XG, it works. Thank you for watching. See you next time.